All right, folks, it's not Monday, not Tuesday, not Wednesday, also not Thursday, it's Friday. I have not worked out since that last bad, bad walk on Sunday. We are gonna try for three miles today. Wish us luck. We're at least getting a mile done. All right, we just did one mile. I don't know what time she just said. Is this blurry? I don't know. Throw it up here, me. That's how fast we did it in, but it is so hot. It's so hot that I don't even care if our pace is bad. It's just right now, it's like getting out here and doing it in the heat because we've never walked in this kind of heat. Minutes. Oh, Jesus Christ. I just did 19 minutes for a mile. All right, we'll check back in at two. Okay, so, oh, we have this fan, but the fan blades are broken, so we're just spraying. But we're almost at two miles. We are not gonna go try to do this like full three mile thing just because it is hot. And usually I have to, I usually I have to put- Is this sweat or is that from the fan? Fan. Oh, okay. I usually have to put um, band-aids on the back of my heels because my shoes cause chafing, blistering, whatever the hell you want to call it. And I forgot. So it's so bad, it's so painful right now, but <sighs> we're gonna finish this up and I will check in with you once we are done. All right, so we just finished. We did 2.75 miles. We decided not to do a three. It was too hot. We were just like, a lot. yeah, I feel definitely exhausted. I'm gonna go run my head under some ice cold water, drink some water. New season of Fortnite today, so we gotta go play that. And tomorrow, hopefully we're gonna try for the three. We're gonna try to go out earlier in the morning so it won't be as hot. That's the hope, but here's the distance and stuff, and here's our pace. See you tomorrow. All right, we are going to attempt to walk. Our goal is at least one mile. My ankles are on fire from yesterday. I don't know who, my shoes are even a little chewed up on the inside, so. I saw that too. I don't know what's worse, my ankle or the shoe. All right, we're giving up. We walked like a little over a quarter mile because my ankles are really, they are really not on. Like somebody, like a child biting ankle kind of thing. Okay, so what I was saying was, we have to give up because my ankles are so not up. I thought, oh, maybe they'll be fine with the band-aids, but I think they're just so raw that, and I'd rather like maybe hopefully let them rest a little bit so that we could try tomorrow. So our plan is we are big Leslie Sinone fans. Sansone, I don't know how the hell you say her last name. It's always been Sinone to me. We love her. We have hundreds of tapes of hers. So we're just gonna do that. We're just gonna like walk here because the whole goal of this is just to get like, what would you say, like cardio, like get your blood pumping. Like I think that's the whole, that's like, stamina. yeah, stamina. That's so as long as we're like getting ourselves like, I think it's fine. So we're gonna do a little Leslie tape because Leslie doesn't just have you walk. Like she's got you like moving and grooving, so. Okay, so last time we spoke, I was getting ready to do my Leslie Sinone tape. We did actually do it. We did the walk at 15, which has like ranges from one to five miles. We did the five mile, which was like about an hour and 19 minutes. I couldn't really like track it since you kind of like walk in place and nothing that I had really would like pick it up, but then she would also kind of like stop and you would like do knee lifts and kicks and all these different things. I mean, I did feel like I got a good workout from it. Do I think it was as beneficial as if I could have actually went and done the walk outside? No, but it was still good just to get a little like cardio going. But honestly, this whole week was really a mess for me. The first few days were just, I had this pain in my leg that would not go away. I tried so many different things to get it to go away. And when it finally did go away, it was Friday when we went out to go and do the walk. And I really chewed up my heels so bad. Like I didn't even say this, but when we got upstairs after we started doing Leslie, my mom saw my heels. She was like, there was, you should have shown me that before because there was no way that I would have actually let you put your foot in a shoe if I saw your heel and how bad it was. And now when I look at my heel, I'm like, yeah, no, I probably should have not tried to get myself up and go walk because my heels are, they're destroyed. They are so, so painful. Like genuinely, I can't even move my ankles without them being in pain. Like I'm just sitting and my ankles are in sheer pain. And I've never had an experience like this before. Like I've gotten like little cuts here and there, but I've never had it where I can't even like just sit bearing pain with my ankles. That's how bad it is. I think at this point, it's a constant theme on this channel that I just struggle so much with wrapping my head around the fact that like, it's okay if you're fatigued or injured to take a break because if you don't, it's only gonna get so much worse. I think what makes this all so much harder is also the fact that like, I already missed one whole week just for the hamstring and now I'm missing more because of my ankle. And I think it's even worse this time because it's so close to the actual race. But I'm also like wrapping my head around the fact that like whatever time I get at this race will be a good time for me. Honestly, just finishing the race will be a big accomplishment for me because I never grew up even doing like any kind of sports at all. I mean, like I tried like t-ball when I was little. I think I did soccer and maybe basketball, but it did not last 
even probably a full year because they are team sports and as somebody who has anxiety, I don't do team sports. So I've never even done anything that is remotely like this, like a sport or anything of that kind. So just crossing the finish line will be an accomplishment in itself. But the plan is to hopefully get somewhat back on track next week because obviously my heels are still not healed yet. I'm doing all the proper procedures to help them heal up, but till then, we just have to kind of wait. But I do hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you next time. Till then, roll the outro.